when you create a roll of button, all you need to do is create two images, and then Dreamweaver will allow you to swap the two images, which makes a rollover. So you can see here that I'm in Fireworks, and I've made my first image, and I've added a background picture, some text, and a box just to help the text stand out. What I'm going to do is I'm now going to save this, and I'm going to go File and Save As, just give it a name, and I'm going to call this Pull Higher 1. And you'll see why I'm putting the 1 on the end in just a second. And I'm going to save that. What I'm then going to do is I'm going to change something about this. So it could be the uh, effect that is on the image. It could be the colour of the text and so on. So if I just do a few quick adjustments to this. I might want to change the colour of that text. It doesn't have to be masses of detail. Just enough that you can see that that has now become a slightly different picture. So let's do something like that. And I'm going to go File and Save As. And I'm going to call that Pull Higher 2. And press Save. We've now got two versions of the same image. Dreamweaver will sort out which is which. Notice that we haven't drawn slices. We don't use slices at all, apart from on nav bars. Once you've got your button drawn out, we can then start to add it into your Dreamweaver file. So I'll just replace this picture with it for the time being. So to do this, we select where we want our button to go, and we go to Insert, and we go to Image Objects, and this time we choose Rollover Image. Now you'll get two options for your images. So your original image is the first one that you made, so press Browse, and find the first one. The Rollover Image is the second version, so press Browse and find the second one. And then what you need to do in your alt text, it's a brief description, so and then you need to put a URL in. So this is your link, so this is going to go to pull higher, so it's going to be the same as what's on there. HTML and I'm going to press OK. So that's put that button in there for me. And if I now preview that, what will happen? is that I'll get my button in there, and when I move my mouse over it, you'll see Dreamweaver will change it from the first one to the second one. And when I click onto it, it will take me through to the right page.